everybody, welcome back. It's me, Tessa G again, and we are playing Bioshock. Uh, as you see, we are still exactly where we left off, because it's not like I went far. Um, and I was just talking about how, yes, I am, in fact, using a controller for this, because I played this on the Xbox first. Um, so I'm afraid that if I switched over to the PC keyboard mouse controls, it would just screw me up and I'd be even worse at this than you're currently seeing. There we go. Clinical trial, lot 44, Dr. Su Chong, client, Fontaine Futuristics. Subject is a white male, one Roland Wallace. Can you hear me, Mr. Wallace? Yes, sir, Mr. Su Chong, sir. Very well. Right, I'm introducing lot 44 now. We have called the name the lot 44 Enrage because of its tendency to. Nurse? That doesn't sound like the trial went real well. Alright, that didn't help. I I'm trying to get into that room. I wonder if I can move this grate. Nope. Huh. You would- Ooh, wait, I forgot to search this corpse. You would think it would involve getting in through this grate somehow to get into that room. Maybe not. Because I want to get the plasma in that room, obviously. Hmm. Let me in! Let me in! No, I guess not. Ah, oh, crap. Ah, crap. I hear a crazy person crying. Sold out? Ah! Alright, there we go. Let's see. I'm supposed to generally go that way. Have I checked everything else in the area? I feel bad. Like, I should be able to get to that plasmid I just saw. And I really want to! And I know I saw a half knocked over door. <coughs> what? Somewhere else? You question my How about you shut the fuck up and die? Yeah, exactly. That's what I thought. And there's a bad turret down that way, or at least a turret that would harm me, let's put it that way. I'm being kind of bullheaded about trying to... Yeah, no. Can I just jump up into there? Okay, I've already it would... Oh wait, no, this is where I got the duh da 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 that one. Yeah, duh. Uh, okay, I'm just being extra special right now. Uh, no. So, how the crap do I get over there? Because I would have thought faux shizzle that it would involve using the new plasmid. The new plasmid! So I get into there. Yeah, I know. But... No, I don't need that. There's nothing else that I can apparently grab. Oh, a safe. I missed a safe. Give it me! Give it me! Uh, buy out $91! Fuck that. Um, I'm not gonna be able to do this, am I? Uh, already no. <laughs> need to replace the very first one. Well, that's why it was a $91 buyout. Ow. Oh, fuck it. That was totally not worth it, was it? It's not, that's 10 bucks, not a thousand. Yeah, 10 bucks. I'm like, there is no way in heck, heck a Rudy, that out of this thousand bucks. Oh, fuck that plasmid. I'm sure it's something important that I'm gonna regret later. Is there 
another one? Or is it just this crazy dude? Alright. Alright. I think we're okay-ish. Except for the whole not having much in the way of ammo thing left. Uh, vending machine. It's not like you get them a lot cheaper, but whatever. I need one that goes not that way. Where is it? No. I need one that goes... This way. Thank you. Thank you. I need to figure out where it goes to up there. Thanks. Gosh, this is going not great. Um, that works. Actually, that 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 does work for a minute. Uh, this way. This one. And then we just need one more. Here we go. Not that I can still afford to purchase much, but I feel like I get XP from it either. Uh, yeah, this general direction. Uh, this way and. Oh, yeah, no, now that I've got, uh... Now that I've actually got... It was a pretty angel, Mr. B. Whee! Got it! Hey! All in a little light? At Circle City, we'll have to work out an affordable payment plan for any major illnesses won't wait until payday. Should Quick, you? someone shut that door! How can I help you if you won't come to me? The artery! Come on, Are you coming back? Uh, I didn't mean to throw a first aid kit at you. I meant to throw your explosives back at you. Come on. dead yet. I've thrown so many grenades back at you by now. I think I got them. Are there just like many of them? Be able to move the jump. I sworn oath to do no harm. And I guess it was just the wind. Did it kill you? Are you dead yet? Are there an infinite number of them? I'm confused. Cause I thought I was supposed to be able to move the debris now that I had telekinesis. It also seems like it's 
almost having no effect on him. There we go. Why are you dragging out your treatment? Come on. I mean, I thought hey, neat. I was supposed to be able to move this big debris out of the way now that I have telekinesis, but I feel like I'm stuck in a forever moving, never ending. Maybe I'm supposed to take the grenade and throw it at the... Oh, I'm stupid. Crap, out of first aid, out of Eve. I just don't need to be out of bullets, please. Is a better weapon? Oh, uh, shotgun, I guess. Oh, I'm gonna die. Because I was dumb. Oh, oh, good. This is a perfect time to reload. Thank you. Oh, I'm dead. I am definitely not going to be alive in a second. Oh, there we go. Alright, not a biggie. No biggie, because I'm not playing in, oh, why do I hate my life mode? Oh, good. Oh, I shouldn't have been standing so close to it. Oh, look, Eve. What I need is health. 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 Oh, no health. Eve is good, though. Ooh, new combat tonic. Static discharge. Ryan Industries introduced the latest in wartime deterrent genetics. That sounds good. As, as somebody with Jewish heritage, wartime deterrent genetics does not sound kosher to me. Anyway, <laughs> static discharge makes you a walking Tesla coil, which does sound good to me. I like Tesla and Tesla coils, but detergent and it sets off all kinds of alarm bells. Anyway, zapping anything and everything foolish enough to strike you. That sounds great to me. Uh, feel safe, be safe with static discharge. I like that. I am so all over that. Oh my god, give me something that gives me L. Yes. Ah, crap. Can we not? Alrighty. Twelve dollar buyout or hack? Uh, hacking will probably kill me, but uh, whatever. So I'm going to slow it down a bit as I'm trying to get to where it's supposed to go. Alright, here we go. This will help a little. Uh, this one. And this one. And that one. And then we should be good. Kapish! Kapoosh! And now it's not trying to kill me. Uh, I can't buy out this one. Oh, fuck! Fudge my life. This has always turned out great for me.
Can we not? Oh, yeah, I guess what I'm not doing, hacking that one again. So, I guess we're not hacking that safe because. Ow! Uh, sorry, safe. I'm a stupid person. Who makes poor decisions in life and is about to get myself kicked in the butt again by a safe. Yep, there we go. Alright, fuck that safe. It apparently does not care to be hacked today. I see another shiny? I thought I saw another. Oh no, that's the same shiny that I just can't pick up. Oh, stuff I could set on fire if I had my uh, fire plasmid prepped, which I don't. This game makes me a little too tense. Buy it out. I do not feel like getting myself kicked in the butt. And I got healed. Uh. Uh. What have I got? No pistol rounds. Alright, I'm moving my shotgun for when I come to a boss. What can I do with this one, Aphrodite? Okay, maybe that you is a boss. Stay still! I want to make them beautiful, but they always turn out wrong! That was too fast! This was too tall! This was too symmetrical! And now- too, too symmetrical? What's this guy? An intruder! He is ugly! 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 I'm just gonna stand over here. Oh yeah. Oh fuck my life! Didn't realize I was supposed to be fighting him already, I guess. Where is he? There he is. Too long with this gun. Switch guns! Yeah, some crazy dude is trying to kill me. That's about all the info I need, really. There we go. I thought that guy was a lot harder. Simon, head back to emergency access. I'm working my way to the back side of Port Neptune myself. We'll get there soon enough. Like, the Dr. Steinman battle? I seem... Maybe I'm thinking of a different boss battle, but... I had thought the Dr. Steinman battle was a lot harder for some reason. Maybe it's a different battle I'm thinking of in this game. It, it pretty much has to be. I just remember that one being, like, kicking my butt a lot harder. <sighs> I just remember, th I mean, not that I'm having, like, a floating good time being super easy with this game. This game is still... Uh, like, the hacks especially are having a good time kicking my bottom. <laughs> and making fun of me and showing what a little dumbass I am. Yup. To prove that I'm not really doing as well as I might otherwise say I am. Ah, uh, yeah, well, that helps a little. Um, but I seem to remember this game being at least a little bit rougher than this. I mean, if you want to see me fail at a game and fail 
hard. You can go watch my Saints uh, Saints Row run through. I'm doing really piss poor on those. And I keep going, but I thought this game wasn't as hard. I seem to remember it being easier. And I seem like a total noobazor on that. So if you want to laugh at me being bad at a game, you can definitely go watch this one. That one. You can watch me try to talk. Is what you can watch me do if you want to see me be bad at something. Um, but my Saints, my Saints Row run through right now is not going the greatest. This is going much better than the first time I played through. There we go. I don't even know why I'm bothering to hack those. Like I said, I don't. It's not like you get XP in the game. And it's not like Doctor Crazy Face. He's here to heal them. To heal off them. Poro silk and up. The nose looks terrific, Dr. Steinman. Doctor? You know, looking at it now, I didn't realize how much your face sags. Scalpel? Excuse me? Scalpel. Uh, Doctor, she's not booked for a facelift. Let's just come in here and... Doctor? Stop cutting! Doctor, stop cutting! Get me the chief of surgery! Get me the chief of surgery now! Adam denies us any excuse for not being beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Do, 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 do. The music in this is really good too. It sets a good atmosphere for what the fuckage. Oh yeah, no, I already went in here. I decided. Oh wait, I think I missed the tape. No, oh, we don't want to miss those if we can avoid it. Aphrodite is walking, shimmering like a scalpel. Stein, she calls. Stein, I have what you're looking. Just open your eyes, and when I see her, she cuts me into a thousand pieces. I think I didn't even have to use bullets on that one. I'm pretty sure that were yeah on the water. Well, that was convenient. <laughs> What's the matter, Frank? Every day there's less and less. You know the problem is not in your hair. Don't forget, it's the crazy bastards up there who I don't have to deal with anymore, so fuck those guys. Sounds like another tunnel collapse. Welcome to Rapture. The world's fastest growing pilot joke. Oh, oh god! Uh, I guess we're not going that way. Nope. Let's try. Uh, hmm? Oh, you want me to go? Ah, oh, I see. We can go this way. Or not? Here's your chance to get some Adam. Oh, I think this is the first time they're gonna have me choose to be a good guy or a bad good guy or a bad guy. <laughs> And me, and all the tasty Adam I can drink. No! No, no! Stay away from her, or it is you who will be shot next. Easy now, Doctor. He's just looking for a wee bit of Adam. Just enough to get by. I'll not have him hurt my little ones. It's okay, lad. That's not a child. Not anymore, are they? Dr. Tenenbaum saw to that. Peter, do not hurt her. Have you no heart? Oh, that's a pretty sermon coming from the Gulu. Cooked up them creatures in the first place. <laughs> Took fine little girls and turned them into that, didn't you? Listen to me, boy. You won't survive without the Adam Dose. Things are carrying. Are you prepared to trade your life, the lives of my wife and child, for ten and bells of Frankenstein? Here! There is another. Use this. Free them from their torment. I will make it to be worth your while. Somehow. I totally forgot about Tenenbaum. 
Like, I remember the choices. I totally forgot about the rest of it. Yeah, yeah, come here, you little brat. Choose whether to rescue the little sister or harvest her. If you harvest her, you get maximum atom to spend on plasmids, but you will not survive the process. If you rescue her, you get less atom, but Tenenbaum has promised to make it worth your while. Yeah, yeah, I'll rescue no, the little bitch. No, no, no. There you go. <laughs> You saved me. The path of the righteous is not always easy. Yes, the reward will become clear in time. Be patient. All right. Okay. Tenenbaum's playing you for a sap. Those things may look like wee little girls, but looks don't make it so. You need all the atom you can get to survive. Yeah. Okay, dude. If you cross paths with another of them. Gatherers garden machines. Make sure you pick up a new plasma or two. That's at the price they say they too dear of course. Oh boy. Uh no, okay. We're gonna call it here because I actually have things I gotta go do anyway, so yeah, we're gonna save it here and we're gonna pick up more of this game next time. Um as usual it's been a ton of fun to play with you guys. Um, if you like what you've seen, please like the video, uh, subscribe to my channel, both on Twitch and on YouTube, and share the video with your friends and your enemies and your frenemies. <laughs> um, and uh, please come join us again on the next video. Uh, this has been Tessa G. We've been playing Bioshock, and I will see you again next time. Bye!